This is the section from the key change to the end and now he plays something slightly different when we get when he gets to the four chord it actually goes to the middle in the new key but it's the middle eight so it's the subdominant chord as a major seventh the four chord in this case now he's actually changed to the key of E flat so it's an A flat major seventh uh, that he gets from um, chord but he doesn't play it as a straight harmony the way the others were this time he arpeggiates the first three strings like that yeah. that's that also the very end we'll get into a discussion about that in a moment so that that's um, picking up the middle eight of the new key so when it changes key it changes straight into the middle eight of the new key the new key being E flat but uh, the first part of the middle of course is the four chord which is the, an, an A flat and that's how it gets to it uh, uh, like that Okay, this is the key change section. end of it and this is where it gets slightly tricky because at this point in time we discover the man isn't playing a single neck guitar in fact we discover that he's playing a twin neck probably even a three but he's using two at, the, at this point in time he's been playing everything in C6 now he switches to B11 and it's the Jules RC B11 this one that has B a, B on the bottom strings, not an F sharp in there. So it's... Which is E, C sharp, A, F sharp, D sharp, B, A, B. And that should be at least a 72 for the bottom string to give it a bit of depth. And how he finishes this section if you notice there was a rather nice augmented run on the 5 chord there, at the, almost at the end. That section there. So it's... And then the augmented run. He now switches next. notice two or three things about that section first of all he slides up with the bass note there also when he plays the final E flat chord he actually starts on the sixth on the C, C note and delays to the very last one just a little bit of tension at the end right at the end instead of going he goes. Then he kills the bottom strings with his finger and slides up. Now if he didn't we would have an awful sound at the end of that glissando. So again the ending from Probably 
execute it better this time. section with him. Thank you. 